Welcome to Quick Learning. In these series of videos and lectures, we are trying to explain different aspects of C++ programming. In last videos, we described about uh, the C++ arrays. What are arrays? How these can be used in our program? From today, we are going to start another exciting topic that is functions, C++ functions. What are these functions? How these are used? This is the uh, some of the agenda items uh, from uh, this uh, uh, topic. What is a function? What are its type? What is the structure? How to declare and implement these function? How to share data among some functions? And what is the scope of variables in C++ functions? So this is the main agenda of this topic that is C++ function. So what is a, a C++ function? The top down design and any program is designed on an approach that a main program is further divided into smaller tasks and each smaller task is implemented in a form of a sub program. So, a C++ function is simply a sub program that has a C++ code and it includes following things uh, like the function name that is the main description and it returns some values from this function. So, going forward. There are a lot of functions that are already built inside C++ plus, but these are not enough to fulfill all the demands of C++ programming. So any user can define its own function based upon its requirement. For example, math.h library is a function that is defined inside C++, but you know we, we, we can uh, use and define our own functions as well. You can see this is a program in which we have included two functions first iostream.h and mass.h then a program is defined in which and a variable x is defined and uh, we are getting the seal and the floor of that variable and the value is returned from this function subsequently. Similarly in C++ we have user defined functions, we can define functions according to as per our requirement and we can use in program at any stage and we will use the function signature and it will we'll save it in .cpp file so that we can use it anywhere afterwards. So what are the main parts of C++, C++ function? It has a function header and the function body function header is normally in this form the return value the name and the parameter list and the body is simply the C++ code that is enclosed with these brackets so here you can see this is a function that is devised to compute the tax of an income we have devised the function compute tax and the variable inside is income and the income is a type double uh, variable so it will uh, get the value of income if it is less than 5000 then return will be zero for this function and it will if it's greater than 5000 then 7 percent of the tax will be uh, deducted so i hope this will be a very exciting session until next time bye bye and keep on listening to our interesting lectures so we have tried to cover some of the main topics of uh, the C++ functions which includes the basic definition, what is the structure of a function, how to define a function, how to use the function in a program, how to create a user specific functions, how to save them in CPC PP files. So we have tried, we have tried to explain some basics of C++ functions. So thank you so much. Until next time, bye-bye.